welcome back everyone to another episode of Tavern Master. Right, so things have been going quite well. Our tables, uh, we've, well, we've got loads of tables actually. Uh, we've got our little adventurous table. We've got a couple of people playing on the podium. Our staff are building up nicely. We've got a little barbecue grill, a takeout counter and our kitchen. So things are looking well over at Grogen's Grog. So what is on the cards for today? I don't actually know. We're going to just start it and see where we end up. So we have got another load of adventurers coming in. Our money is on minus 275, which is kind of low. It's kind of low, but we will build that up quite quick. Our drinks are all stocked up. We've got wine, ale, water, lemonade, and beer. Um, our kitchen crate is looking okay, to be honest. We started building up strawberries, cheese, and mushrooms. So these ingredients are going to build up more because we're doing the adventurers stuff now as well. Um, yeah, everything else there is fine. We are just going to carry on going with this until we make a little bit of money. We need to start getting some more decorations so we can raise our prestige a little bit. Just so we can do some more of these events. The next one would give us 10 cheese and a new recipe. It's kind of good, isn't it? So we need 1,500. We're nearly at 1,300, so we're getting close to that as well. Right, we have got something on our menu. We have leveled up our bread, so we are at three stars. That gives us 37 coins for each bread we sell now, but it uses two wheat. That's not so bad, I guess. Right, we have made 600 quid already, so let's go to our adventurers thing. And we are going to try and get... We're going to try and get some mushrooms. Let's try and get some mushrooms. One, two, three. That's kind of low. That's kind of low. What about this one? 92%. Looks good. That looks good. And we've completed these two. We're going to get some peas. Four peas. Four peas in a pod. Uh, and we got some more cheese as well. Did we complete it? We did. Ten extra cheese. Right. Let's see. What have we got in there now? So we got mushrooms. A few green peas. Quite a lot of cheese and some strawberries. So we need coconuts and walnuts still. And a bit of meat. But our money's building up really fast. Let's see what we've got here. Buy a chopping table for the kitchen. Now, can we do this yet? Let's just slow this down one second and have a look at what we can buy. Um, Buildings. We can't do any of these. These are just walls. Special. It's still the same thing. On this one, tables. We could get a nice big table there. Soon. No, not yet. Seats, decorations. We might get some decorations. That would be really good, actually. That gives you 220. Which would actually give us enough for our next event. We'll keep an eye on that one for a minute. Our lights. Specials. Okay. So we got our... We've got all this. What is that one? Place for waitresses. Oh, we've not got one of them. Let's buy one. Let's buy one. We need somewhere for our waitresses to wait. Should we just have them there? Maybe have them there. They can greet people as they come in. We're only going to get one for now. Yeah, we'll just get one. Because I don't actually know what it is. Right, if we get... Oh, the size of that bar. That's well better than what we've got. And that one's kind of cool as well. Maybe. We're not going to get it yet. When we expand a little bit, we'll get a better bar like this. Right, our kitchen. We can actually afford a chopping table now. Okay, so where do we want to put this? We haven't really got the space for it yet. We're going to stick one right there. I know it's a little bit in the way, but we are going to expand pretty soon. We might have to move this. I don't know whether we can. We should be able to. But we bought our kitchen. We have just gained 250 coins for that as well. But let's have a little look at our walls. Build. That one. And we are going to go. Let's just start here. Yeah, because we can have a separate room. If it comes to it anyway. There we go. So that is that. We could do with some windows. But one there. One there. And one there. Have we got enough money for another one? No, we need an extra 20 coins for that. We do need to knock this wall down now. Do we get anything back for you? We don't. Oh, our prestige has just gone down. Why? We just lost loads of prestige. Oh, is that because we've got grass in our house now? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> oh, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. 
Close texture. Right, there we go. That's better. But we have lost loads of prestige. We need to build this up again now. So we're going to have to get more decorations and stuff. Right, where do we want to put this? How do we move it? Just in case we end up with a fire, we will put you on this wall there next to our little guys. And we haven't really got any money to do anything else just yet. But look at all that space. Look at all that space. We're going to need some lights. We're going to need some lights. Oh, we never collected our 250. That's even better. Now we've got some. Lights. Let's get... We have got enough for a nice big chandelier. What about one of these? Oh, look at that. That lights the whole room up. Just about there. That's well better than getting all them little lights. Right, if we click on you. I don't know what that means. Excellent wax and oil quality. There we go. So we've got ourselves a little chandelier that covers up most of this room. We need to start earning a little bit more money now. We have just completed the research as well. So we have got props for soup. Okay. We can unlock a new floor, but let's get some plants for the kitchen. That needs us to serve 50 rare people. So we need to do some more events. And our prestige has gone up a little bit now as well. So let's get the next day started. Okay, so it's raining. We're going to lose a few customers from this one. But... Oh. Look at our money, minus 563. That is shocking. Right, we can organise another little event. Let's do a regular party because we need this for our research anyway. And we've got another quest. Buy a basin for the kitchen. Right, should we move? Oh, we've run out of something in here. We need wheat. We need money. We need money to buy wheat. Right, I'm thinking of moving the kitchen. No, we can't actually. Can I move this? Can, but can I move that? Oh, we can't. Maybe. I don't actually know where to move this. I might move that next to the front door. Possibly. And then move the kitchen. I don't know where either. But let's just grab one of this. Not that. We need the wall. Build another wall. And we're going to take down this one here. Okay. That's opened up a bit of space. We will move you. To the corner down here. It's going to take us a little bit of sorting out to decide what we want to do in this little section now. Our kitchen's not big enough though. That's that's a say, uh, like a given. Maybe we should just wait until I've got a bit more money and extend this bit here. And then we can put our kitchen over on that side. Like have this whole section as the kitchen. I think that might be better. Keep this wall in. And then just have the kitchen there. Right, we've got some money. Let's buy some wheat. There we go. Our lemonade is getting a little bit low. We're going to have to top that up a bit. And our ale as well. We can get much in there. But we need to try and make a little bit money, bef a little bit of money before the end of the day. Right, I think it's... It was at 100 per wall. 50. So we could do three. Can we do the flooring while we're waiting? Let's give our kitchen its own little floor. Just like that. And maybe that too. You know what? I kind of like the way this is going. I might put a little wall there and have this section open for the kitchen and then take this wall away. Let's get our last piece of wall on the outside. And then we need to buy a special counter, which we are going to put. We need to move some stuff first. Where do we want to move stuff? We'll move you. To there for now. We're going to move... Let's take away... That wall. Just so we can get our people in the kitchen. And we're going to start moving some of this stuff down. So we're going to put our little cabinet there. Alright, let's go. So, next up, we want to do another one of these walls. And see if we can build that to there. So now we've got a separate kitchen. Shall we give them a window? One like there and one there. And maybe one at the back. Oh, we don't have enough money. Doesn't matter. Right, we've got to the end of the day and we've lost money again, which is shocking. But it's okay. 
we're just going to start our next day anyway. And we've got another thief coming in. And our guard has fought him off. And he's running for his life. You've successfully defended against the thief. We are at minus 600 and two now. All the guests for this event have been saved. You get 200 coins as a reward. So we're only at minus 300 now. We need to buy some more stuff for that soon. And we're going to need meat fairly soon too. It's our chefs are all looking a little bit bored. Our adventurer people, we cannot do anything with you. But we have got a completed one, which was a failure. Better luck next time. So our money is coming back up fairly quick. I need to know if people can get to this. I'm wondering if they would just walk around this way and queue up there. We'll have to wait and see. Our tables are not full. We could actually do with more people. I know this is an event that only holds 20 people, but at the same time, we do need the money. Our money seems to go up quite slow when we're having an event, I think. But let's buy some lemonade. This is kind of a lemonade party, so... Let's sop the beer. And a bit of ale. No one drinks our water. We could probably get rid of one of them, I think. <laughs> well, you, you don't expect them all to drink water in the pub. But you might mix it with stuff, maybe. Glass of water with your food. Right, our chefs are not doing anything. Is there any reason for this? I don't know. Right, we're going to be well in the red again when the next day starts. Let's see. Alyssa has leveled up. We're going to give her more tips. All our people are quite happy apart from Isaac. We're going to just raise his salary to 32 and make him happy. And that's everyone sorted out there. On our quests, save 50 rare customers by organising events. We gained an extra four points for that one. So we're at 77. We have almost got a new recipe. So we need two more decorations and we get another four there. A basin for the kitchen. Start the next day. Another day of rain. The adventurers are all coming in. Our little entertainers are coming in. I think we can get a second floor on it, so we might have to keep a separate area for stairs. Now, I'm also thinking we should probably move this to around there. We probably need another light in this area, so I'm thinking another chandelier to cover this section. And the kitchen needs another light too. We'll sort that out. Right, our money is coming back now. How are we doing for stock? Getting a bit low on meat still. We never bought any. Right, now I've just seen which way they're going for this. We are going to turn it round that way. Just there. So our money is building up. We are going to spend it straight away on meat. Just to top that up. And when we get more, we need some fruit and some wheat. Our people are well down today, though. We we might have to start getting more tables in. And can we buy any more drinks for this place yet? Let's see. Wine. Was wine the last one that we bought? Oh, milk. We can do milk, mead, and cider soon. Beer, water, wine, ale, lemonade. Oh, I forgot about the wine. It's all the way down there. All right, let's raise the prices of the wine, actually, because I don't think we've done that one. Let's not, let's raise the price of lemonade because that seems to be what we're selling the most of. Okay. Start the next day. We got 312 at the start. But we go down to minus 334. So we need to find a way to make more money. Right, we have got people queuing up. Well, a person queuing up outside here. So it is working. We've got two people standing inside each other, more or less. Now we've got to... Uh, let's see. Let's have another event. We'll just do a lemonade party again tomorrow. We have got Isaac who is leveled up. So we're going to give him skills for main courses. And that's all. And this one. Right, we have done a quest. Make sure all staff happiness is above 80%. So our staff are quite happy. We have learned a new recipe. Oh, okay. So we have got... We've leveled up our bowl of chicken soup. We got steak, fish. So what was the recipe we just learned? Event food? Oh, we got strawberry cake for the events. Some crates are missing food. Okay. What are we missing? Wheat. We'll fill you up and we'll fill you up. 
We're just going to do them all. Okay, so now we're a little bit poor, but we're... Okay. Right, lemonade for the party. That's got to be topped up. If we click on this, to refill all for 178. There we go. That'll do. So our money's looking a little bit better. I am thinking of getting... Look at all the stuff on the tables. We might need another waitress. But before that, we can level up our steak. That gives us 50. 50. Wow. And uh, we've got a member of staff leveled up. Matilda, you can do speed while carrying. And Lauren, you can have more tips. I don't know whether that's more tips for her or more tips for us. I don't know. Start the next day. Okay, we've got no money left again. But we have got another quest. Buy a cauldron for the kitchen. Cauldron. Cauldron for the kitchen. All the guests have been saved and we are back up to... The plus. The plus is in the money. Okay, right, so let's see what we can buy for our kitchen. Got a cauldron. What's that? A basin. So we need 450 for a basin. 250 for a cauldron. And a spice shelf. We need that for 400. So that's going to be our next little purchases. Did we actually gain any stuff for these? No, we don't get any prestige for them, but we need them. So we're going to have to do it. But that is a decent sized kitchen, isn't it? Okay, so we have got 250 quid now. And I'm going to see if we can buy one of these things for the kitchen. So we can afford a cauldron. But we should we? Yeah, we'll start with the cheapest one. Oh, sh that's the wrong button. The cauldron is actually quite small. So where do we want to stick this? We're going to put it next to... Next to the grill. And that should have completed the quest. There we go. We've got another five points. We are only three points away from another 300 coins. And we can nearly get a new recipe as well. Let's get another adventurer's thing out. While we've got a little bit of money, we can do... Search the forest. We've got a lot of people in today. We should have 100% on this one gonna cost us 190 quid but we might get 15 more strawberries okay so at the end of the day for the october the first we have minus 275 quid which isn't too bad i suppose but we are at minus 473 for the end of the day how are we doing for food everything is still topped up nicely i think that event saved us quite a bit of stuff but we've got our adventurers are back in we've got our musicians and the people are starting to come and fill the tables our new quest buy any ingredient 50 times that'll just come on its own but we do need some decorations at some point we're gonna get a spice shelf and we're gonna get a basin so there's another 10 points coming in pretty soon and that'll get us close to a new recipe right how long are our people waiting do we need to hire any more staff yet we do need another waitress gets five tips for every food served okay we're gonna hire matilda Costs us a little bit more money, but we need it. We need it. All right, we've got enough money now for our spice rack. Kitchen, spice rack. We're going to stick you right about there. Complete that quest. And we get 300 coins, which is going to mean that we have got enough to buy our cauldron. Oh, not our cauldron, our wash basin. Let's put the wash basin right there next to where the chefs can wash their hands. And we'll complete that quest. Lovely. So we have got 360 now. I'm going to buy another table for our, for our people. And we'll stick one right there. And then we need a couple of seats. Right, that seat is a bit rubbish. But what if we buy start buying better seats now? And we gain prestige for doing this you can only afford the one for a minute it might be time to start upgrading all of our stuff soon so we have got bert has leveled up and we're going to give him more speed on drink pouring and that research is done now so we have got more plants in the kitchen we can research kitchen items level two milk cider and mead that one might actually be a good one that needs us to save 25 rare people and 50 regular. So that's not too bad. We can do another event to get that one up and running. Let's get an event for Friday. We'll do you. Our drinks, we need more lemonade. Oh, that was a thing. We wanted to raise the price of the lemonade. 
I'm going to take it up to seven. And we're going to fill it up. Let's fill everything up. While we got money before the day ends. And total 420. There we go. Everything is full at the end of the day. We're a little bit poor. And our guard has got to fight out, fight off a new thief again. Right. Chefs on floor zero don't have enough cauldrons to prepare all the soups. We need another cauldron? Oh, no. Right, let's move you down one then. And move you down. And we're going to have to buy another cauldron today. Looks like that's what we're doing. Prepare roasted fish 25 times. Buy any ingredients. Oh, we've done that one. We've got a new recipe. But we have completed the search forest and we got 15 strawberries. How are we looking for our strawberries and stuff now? Strawberries are looking quite good. Green peas are still a four of them. That's not great. Look how busy we are. There's people everywhere. One more coin. There we go. Kitchen. Cauldron. Oh, I did have enough. I was looking at the wrong thing. Okay, can we do enough soups now? It's still saying we haven't got enough. This isn't good. We're going to need another one. We're going to need another one. Let's buy. Kitchen. Cauldron. It's funny that they weren't complaining, right? When we didn't have any. Isn't it? <laughs> Let's buy two there. Right? And we are going to move. You to there. And you to there. And then you can come down. You can actually stay there. Hey, we got 141. How much was that next chair? 150. Here we go. Better. We're at 1220 now. Another 380 and we're good. We have had a recipe. Level up our fish steak. We've got our average food. Our food is going well. 102 points. So 8 more points gets us 350 more coins. And we have had a, a member of staff level up. Lauren. You can. Speed. You're quite slow actually. We'll give you that one. Speed while carrying. At the end of the day we made 329. So today went quite well. Right. While we've still got a bit of money before the next day starts. Let me buy another table and chairs. Right. Seats. We're going to get the good ones though. Or a good one. And we'll start the next day with a minus 630 loss. The adventurers are coming in and we're getting some people in for the party. We've saved all our guests. We gained 200 coins. And we've got another one there. Buy any ingredient 50 times. Refill 250 litres of any drink. We've only done the fish 2 out of 25. And we still do need to buy some more decorations. We have had a member of staff level up though. Abram. And we're going to give you skill for soup. Perfect. The days when we have our events are fairly quiet. Not going to lie. And we don't seem to make as much money as a normal day. But it's okay. If we look at our lighting, we're still missing some over here. So we are going to get another chandelier at some point. And we'll probably just stick it over here by this door. Maybe. Or maybe in the middle. And we could get rid of some of these ones. Because I don't think we would really need them. I wonder if that area is better than this area because it's brighter i don't know so we're just waiting on a little bit more money to buy our next bench and then i think we're all sorted for our kitchen yeah we we do own everything that we've unlocked we need to do some more research we could actually buy more decorations for the kitchen because we bought we got some plants didn't we kitchen plants oh I like these ones there sausages herbs they actually give you quite a lot of prestige for very little cost. That could be a thing we do. Let's see, if we buy one of them. Oh, look, they go above everything else as well. That's kind of cool. Well, yeah, that's coming. That's coming. Eventually. Plus, it'll give us our next quest for our decorations as well. So, I think we needed about... 150 coins to get that next bench. So we have got enough for our bench before the day ends. So let's grab the seat. Put it there. Lovely. 
is this the full size that we can go to let me just check on our building for our walls oh no we can come out this way a little bit more but that's all and that's our maximum size expansion but that's okay i think we're doing well with what we've got everyone's gone home except for the adventurers who were all sitting in the back miles away from the front door we could add a little back door i guess i don't know don't think we need to let's start the next day minus 700 coins the next lot of adventurers are coming in we can't tell them to do anything because we've got nothing nothing to set it off with right we need lemonade pretty soon and our food is actually doing okay hey okay, our money is coming back fairly quick now that our pub is getting really full look at how many people we've got in here 104 customers are going to come in throughout the day 46 are coming in because of the prestige so we we really could do it open that as quick as we can okay so we have got 500 coins we are gonna buy ourselves a new light we're gonna get this one again because i think it'd be nice to just keep it in line with what we've got and that should give us decent coverage and 1400 prestige now we need to find uh, some nice decorations i think to go around the place i don't like the way they just go on the floor i do like how these go up the wall though so i'm thinking we could how much are they 75 and they give us 70 prestige each what if we do oh what you can't buy a new prop oh okay oh i see there's our waitress thing all right we're gonna stick you there and we're gonna buy another one of them we don't have enough cash but that's give us took us up to 1600 will that give us enough let's just claim this first we own three decorations takes us to 106 fish is at four we're going to refill our stuff soon and buy some more ingredients as well we have got a member of staff judy has leveled up we're going to give you speed while carrying speed while not carrying might be a good one because you've got to do lots of cleaning up i guess we can now do this event wine tasting wine goes for seven coins in the wine tasting and we can do oh we don't have any cheese right we are going to have to go and do some more adventurous stuff to get cheese that one we haven't got enough stuff but we do have the ingredients for some things i think and we start it it actually looks like we can all right we're gonna start the next day on the adventurers table can we do one for cheese we're gonna do this one to protect 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 the wagon as soon as we got enough coins let's speed that back up over there we have got a new quest own five carpets we own four right now which isn't bad which isn't bad we can afford one but i want to wait until this adventurers guild has got enough money to do what we're doing with it 183 we got 164 nearly there there we go we are good to go so that gets us nine cheese we're just going to select you know what we'll send them all we'll send them all so we need to buy one more carpet decorations no nope. is it in flooring oh there it is carpets so we're going to stay in the same theme with our carpets and we're going to buy one there one there and we can't buy that one but we did finish a quest so that's all good one short of 350. our pub sounds really loud look at this all our tables are full apart from maybe one seat this couldn't be going much better right we have got loads of stuff there now we're going to try and fill this up that's that and then we're going to do the same with our drinks refill all we need 305 but look how fast that money's coming in there we go everything is topped up and we are good to go we finished the research and we've also finished two more quests we've done 250 liters and 50 ingredients and we got 350 coins as well fantastic right what have we done our research was complete what did we get there milk cider and mead so we're going to be saving a bit of money for this now 
kitchen items level two. Oh, we're going to do this one. Start research for 21 guests a day. We made a nice little tidy 57 coin profit today. And let's have a quick look at this. Now we can buy a milk barrel 700, cider barrel 700, and a mead barrel for 700. This is going to give us so much variety for all our people. But that is where we are going to finish off for the day. Everyone, thank you so much for watching. Really does mean a lot. Hope you are enjoying the game so far. If you're new to the channel, if you are enjoying it, please hit that subscribe button. If you enjoyed the episode, hit the like button and drop some comments down below. Let us know what you think so far. I want to say a massive thank you to all the people who signed up on the Patreon and joined as members. It really does mean a lot. Thank you so much. And we'll see you soon. Thanks, everyone. Bye.